Hello and welcome to the whiskey.com news on the 27th of September 2021. We have a number of very interesting news and a lot of new bottlings to be released and to be announced. We start off with the far, far north of Scotland on the Isle um, of Orkney and the Highland Park distillery has a new Highland Park called Viking Heart. It's a 15 year old Highland Park in a ceramics bottle that was inspired by the ceramic jugs that they used to store the whiskey in. And it is actually a core edition. So this bottling is here to stay. It's the new 15 year old expression from Highland Park. It's 44% ABV and hopefully we will have that on our cask soon. Then we go over to Macallan. They also extending and they're doing the double cask series with a 30 year old expression it's a combination between sherry american sherry oak and european sherry oak with 43 percent abv and it will be sold at around four thousand us dollars so it will be really really expensive and now we have the first news about a Christmas edition 2021. And it is the Big Pete Christmas edition with a cask strength of 52.8% ABV. No coloring, no chill filtering as we know it. And then we have this bearded fisherman who is sliding up and down Isla on his sledge. Yeah, very nice thing. Then we have also seven new editions for the distillers edition and they will be available at the end of october as we know them they're all double matured with a finish in sweet wine casks maybe we'll find some of them here on the cask but maybe not then we have the distel group they are also releasing uh bottlings they are for limited edition we have a deanston 12 oloroso cask matured a tobomori 17 oloroso cask matured a Ligic 22 a px cask pedo Chemines cask matured and the buna heaven aunat vetting from uh, sherry and port wine sounds really good all are in cask strength and will be on the market very soon then we should look over to Ireland and they are releasing uh, cuvee. Uh, the Waterford distillery is releasing a cuvee. Usually the Waterford distillery only does single farm whiskies where they take only the grain or the malt from single farms, process it and write it all down that this is from this farm. And now they are mixing 25 of these single farm whiskies together and creating a cuvee 50 percent abv not chill filtered not colored and matured in french and american oak then we have the red breast the other um irish distillery they are uh, enlarging their iberian series with a px edition so a pedro Jimenez whiskey after maturing in ex bourbon and the Loroso cask, it was then finished in Pedro Jimenez casks. 46% ABV, no uh, chill, uh, chill filtration. And unfortunately, will only be uh, available in Ireland and Great Britain so far, but maybe that will extend it to an international market. Then we come to Bosch Mills and they are releasing the Causeway Collection. The Causeway Collection 2021 is now 12 single molds between an age of 9 to 32 years. Last year they only had the Causeway Collection with three bottlings. All of them are not chill filtered. And now we have a last news from the new continent, the United States. And Jim Beam is bringing out a limited edition Jim Beam Black for the 43rd Riders Cup. It's an exclusive uh, golf event and it has a limited, um, yeah, limited design where they're showing the, uh, the golf course of the Whistling Straits. Unfortunately, it's just a very yeah, special bottling for the United States only. So everybody in the international markets, you cannot reach it, unfortunately. Yeah, that was it. Thank you very much for watching and see you next time.